is a specific question for Father Martin. Okay. Can you elaborate more your thought that for us Christians, the highest expression of our, of our identity is the capacity to self-donation without disregarding self-care? I think that, well, if I start with a theological, philosophical approach, maybe that will take me quite long. But I think that we have to reinforce uh, graciousness, gratuitousness, as the basis of reality. We have stressed very much the fact that we are rational animals. So we have a privilege. We are superior to the others. We have understood that as a privilege. I remember once I was in, in England and they gave me a, a poster with a tiger. And it, it, it says, how can, I be, how can I be humble when I am so good, as, when somebody is so good as me? So we have uh, stressed privileges, differences. We have to stress the opposite. Uh, the saying by Descartes, I think, therefore I am, should be changed to I am. I, I have been thought, I have been loved, therefore I am. At the beginning is the loving freedom of somebody who thought of you without you deserving anything. So if everything is the fruit of a loving freedom, I cannot stress separation and privileges. Everything I have is to share. Everything is to self-donate. Because self-donating, I become more and more myself. And in this way, I think it's also important to distinguish clearly between the technological and the anthropological dimensions of communication. If you remember, Socrates never wrote a letter because he thought that writing was not a right technique. Plato, Plato tell, tell, tells us about this. So this polemic, this debate comes from, from centuries. The, te the technique, uh, the technologies help us to be connected, but communication is much more. We can be very connected and very alone. So we have to distinguish clearly this. <clears throat> uh, for instance, with respect to empathy, there are some studies who show that people who use the, mo the most the, the new technologies are the less empathic. So that, that's, that's a bit uh, worrying. So technology can help but can also isolate us. We have to change our mentality. We are for self-giving because we are the fruit of the of gift. If we change this mentality, everything changes. Also, when we approach the ecological uh, sphere, I think there are three ways of approaching, main ways of approaching the, uh, the ecological. One is the dominion one, the anthrop anthropocentric. Mm dominate, to do what I like. Another one is the, uh, the steward administration. Uh, God has uh, given us this to administrate properly. But I think that even this one is not enough. We have to arrive to a third way. Because being an administrator, maybe we think we are administrating something that is not really us that we are also only in charge of something as a steward. As a, and that is, is not very compelling. We have to arrive to the Franciscan way, to the St. Francis way, to feel brothers and sisters, to feel joyfully united to, to people. So self-giving. If we arrive to this stage that only the mystic can arrive, contemplation will be possible. 
and our approach to everything will be different. Even our our being in the net in the in the life in the net. Okay, I think it's enough.